Yo, what's going on, sexy someone? Let's go to here doing a rank one v one. I'm playing Vamana because you know what? I figured. <clears throat> excuse me. I figured I haven't played Vamana in a while. He's playing Mulan, and I'm actually fighting Warchi. Warchi, the the sensation, the king himself. This will be fun. I actually don't think I care about going. Yeah, I don't. Th I was gonna say like, I want to go transcendence, but I don't think I care about transcendence. I I think I'd much rather just go attack speed, right out the gate. Cause like late game I win, right? Early game he wins, cause early game Mulan damage is really good, but late game we should be okay, I think. Yo, I clear so fucking slow, dude. My god. I guess I only have seven power, to be fair. But Jesus. He went. He went for the the double defense, boy. I'm gonna hit the smack on him for the warrior's blessing stack. Alright, I got my Warrior's Blessing there and he didn't get his, so that's good. I wait to clear so I can get a third stack while he only gets his his next one, you know? Not bad. We're doing okay. We're doing even better because I'm not wasting gold on pots because I have Chalice, so. I'm just going to go back now. This is not bad, dude. This really isn't bad. My goal is to just maintain equilibrium in the early game and then win in the late game. He's staying here. He had a perfectly timed back because me staying means I can't finish boots. But that's okay. Don't let him sneak up on you. Oh, man. That's unfortunate. Alright. Uh, let's see, if he stays we can kill him. He has shell, but... Yeah. I expected him to, if he does, 3 me there. The only reason he ever does that is because he wants to shell and try to bait me a fight under tower. So basically, I just... I let him 3 me in order for him to shell. <laughs> and then I just walked away. That was my whole game plan. And it actually worked, which is good. I'm going to go breastplate next because my passive means some of my physical power... Or some of my uh, physical defense turns into power. Which is good. I would love to pick up speed buff, but I can't. It's much better if I just go blue buff here. I'm actually a little bit surprised he's not invading this. I, I don't think he's using... I don't think he's taking advantage of his, his Mulan early game. But to be fair, the early game is only good if you hit the three. Alright. 
Hmm. All right, we traded. I don't think it matters, honestly. I mean, it kind of sucks that he hit the three. He wasn't even aiming me, by the way, or aiming at me when the three hit me, but it like shot out of his hip or something, but it's okay. It's all right. I had to use, a, like, if I had even 0.1% more attack speed, I would have gotten that next auto off, and I would have been able to kill him for free and gotten out during my ult, but instead, it didn't happen like that. But I was able to make it to the buff quicker, which is really good. Helps me with my clear. That's down, I remember him getting it. I'm gonna go breastplate here. So he's building these bruisery items, like um, he's going berserkers here or glad, it's more than likely berserkers, but he's building this item so that he has this bruiser build. It's better for like early game, I guess, which is Mulan's strong suit. Ooh, good hit. Um, I don't think he wins this. Yeah, he's just gonna run away. I'm cool with that. I need a lookout. Just want that warrior's blessing in the feet. You feel me? All right, we stopped his heal, which is amazing. Yeah, good stuff. Good stuff. We can get a shell here again. Potentially. Alright, nice. Shell down. We can push this wave as well because my three is still up. Thank you, Breastplate. And then I'm going to go into Stone Cutting next. Stone Cutting is such a great item. So basically this game I'm going to want Ichabal, Stone Cutting, Atalanta's Bow and Kins. And if I need to I'll go Hasten, but I shouldn't need to. We're a little bit ahead. This is good. Being, like I said, being even or, or uh, even ahead is really good against Mulan because Vimana's late game being so auto attack focused is going to be so much better. Not to mention how much free fucking power I get out of my ult. Let's see, he doesn't scare me actually. Not yet. Oh, he missed that. That's good. Hit that slow. I'm just gonna ult away. That's all right. <clears throat> I figure we'd trade alt for alt most of the time this game. I just missed that. Pathetic, but it's okay. Um, let's see if I can confirm red here. Comboing my three with my two. Nice. Get away from me. Hmm. Oh, he's got that, uh, that Berserker Shield proc. That's why he's beating my ass. I mean, getting red buff there is fine. And honestly, I wasn't scared of dying because I had I had shell if I needed it. I really didn't want to use shell, but it was there if I needed it. We're pretty close to the finish stone cutting. Only one more wave and we can go grab that. There's nothing really up on the map to farm. You scare me, so I'm going to run away. Nice, I got the XP for that. All right, cool. Let's go get our stone cutting and our thorns. This will go well with my six shooter. Honestly, I actually I wonder if maybe I shouldn't have gotten thorns. Maybe I should have gotten horrific. Because if I get his alt and then I horrific and alt, he gets completely smacked. All right, I guess tower's mine. Tower. 
Oh, he finished his itch of all. That's what he was waiting on. Oh, that hit me. The reason I pop thorns and my ult is because it just pushes him away for free here. Yeah. All right. Let's see. I'm all about the farm game right now. I just want to get XP and push my lead because the the further ahead I get, the easier it is. Like the or not even the further ahead I get. This, that makes too much sense, but the later the game gets, the easier the game gets for me, so. <clears throat> I'm going to match his Itchaval here. That's a fine piece right there. He's got a 118 defense compared to my 151, and he's got less power. He's got 135. I have 124. Well, he he has 135 with, it, with his Itchaval stack. <clears throat> so I guess he has more power when it's stacked, but... Yeah, he only has 90 when it's not stacked, so I have a lot more power than him. Mm. He just walks at me in autos, huh? Oop. Oh, that that second too is long range, huh? If I get my uh, if I get my thorns up, I can win the fight, even with him having itch evolved. Because stone cutting is OP. Just gonna alt away. I'm just gonna run at him with my alt up. Good stuff, dude. Very good stuff. I was waiting exactly on him to turn. He knew he was going to die there if he didn't try to do something, like with his three and a turn. So I was just waiting on, on him to turn, and then I was going to Thorns. Worked out exactly how I wanted. Good stuff. Am I going to have to shell this? No. Okay. Good. Itch of all completed. And now, because I've finished Ichabal and I have Stone Cutting Sword, there's literally no chance in hell that he ever outboxes me with auto attacks. I mean, unless I don't have ult. But I'm not gonna fight him if I don't have ult. That's idiotic. I don't even. I don't even need thorns. I think I could just run at him. He got serrated. No, he only got tier two. Or whatever that is. Right, I'm gonna go get his tower. I think he's just going to clear and do red buff and shit like that. But I have 1.7 attack speed. I can get this with no problem. Oh, he actually didn't do red buff. That's surprising to me. He's just going to alt away. And I am going to just alt this. Like I said, he can't, he can't out-trade me at all. This is completely free at this point, I think. And Mulan dealing with fire minions is rough to say the least. Okay, I'm going to run this way. Oh. I'm garbage. Excuse me. He just surrendered. <laughs> hey man, that was a good. That was against Warchi. He's like a. He's a GM every single split. Number one in the world. Latin player. Pro player. Most viewed YouTuber in the entire world. He's a good player. I beat him. GG. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. 
Until next time, guys. Peace.